Hi guys, it's Taff. Welcome to Car Mechanic Simulator 2014. I've been nagged to play this game, so here we are. 2014. Oh wow, look. Brilliant. That's impressed me already. We can move that around and look at the light effects. Brilliant. Okay, let's begin. I've done very little on this. I haven't even created a profile. Look at that. Uh, so let's just quickly create a profile. Uh, save. Uh, play. So we got Endless, which is locked. We got Career, which is no save gate. Okay, yeah, Career. And we're away. We're a mechanic. That was that easy, people. So there you go. If you're looking for Career's advice, sign up, put a profile on, and we're now a mechanic. And we've got our own garage. Look at this. Welcome to Car Mechanic 2020. 2024? No, 2014. 2024 is the perfect game for mechanics, but we have to settle for 2014 at the moment. In this tutorial, you'll learn the basics of gameplay in the first garage of the basic garage. Blah, 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 blah. Diagnostic paths with chip tuning. Okay, let's start with the basics. The A. So, W A S D keys to move. Well, near the radio, left click mouse. Where's the radio? Whoa! Hello! Somebody's been sniffing the fuels. Wow! This is super sensitive. Um, I might need to turn that down. There's the radio. Whoa! 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 Okay, hang on. Let's just quickly. I told you I hadn't. Oh, hang on. How do we. Uh, okay, let's, let's just, I'll, try, I'll change that, whoa, change that for next time, so let's just, <laughs> bloody hell, click the radio on. Hooray, tutorial, you've completed the tutorial, no we haven't, we now have to go to car lifter, car lifter, okay, it's got the blue haze around it, brilliant. Click. And the car lifter. Oh look, there's birds. Um, this concludes the basic first tutorial. Wow, that really was a basic first tutorial. Don't worry, don't worry, don't, don't worry about the mechanics. We we can figure that out. Now we know how to switch the radio on and lift the cars up and down. The rest is, I'm sure, we'll work it out. You know, I can ride a bike, so I'm sure I'll pick this up pretty quick. Right, um, your first customer has arrived. The job description goals are listed in the repair order. Okay, brilliant. So, repair order: replace front brake pads, check front disc. Okay. Uh, yes, uh, can you change the brake pads on the front axle and check the condition of the brake discs, please? I'll be back tomorrow to collect my car. 500 US dollars. Okey cokey. I wish I could change that to uh, British pounds, but uh, you have replaced, uh, you have to replace brake pads. Go to the PC and four new brake pads. Okay. PC. Woo, woo. God, we're still drunk. Here we go, the computer. Um, used car parts, learning ebooks. Bank loan. Apply for no, we better not. <laughs> um, car parts. Right. Is there any way we can um, filter this? No. Okay. We'll just have to scroll down. Brake pads. Fifty US dollars. Okay. One. Is that a pair? or Is that for a single? Brake pad. So I think that's single. So let's buy four. There we go. Now we got to go and inspect the wheel. Okay. Brilliant. How do we get out of this? How do I, how do I get out? How do I, how do I? Hello? I can't. Escape. Escape gets us out. Brilliant. Okay, here's the car. It's a nice little um. I don't know what it is. Nice little uh, hatchback. Anyway, is it hatchback? Yeah. Right. Let's uh, wheel inspection. Here we go. Right. So we got disassembling parts. We got assembling parts. Oh, red and green. Yep, yeah, fine. And we got examination, which is that bit. Um, switch between the actions. Open quick menu by pressing the white. Okay, brilliant. Tutorial. Let's stay disassemble mode. Uh, disassemble mode. Johnny Five, disassemble. We may take out. The okay, fantastic. Right. Um, so if I go right mouse pad, here we go. So we want disassemble. Disassemble mode. So oh, here we go. Take the. Take the, uh, the bolts out. You should really only loosen them before you put the jack in. You should loosen the bolts, jack the car up, then remove them. Yeah, yeah. I once saw somebody jack the car up and try and remove, uh, loosen the bolts uh, when the car was in the air and it just kept falling over and you could just see this crunch as the, uh, the jack kept falling over and kept scratching all the way down his car. I didn't. I didn't. He didn't want uh, any help, so I didn't offer any. So uh, <laughs> there we go. Right, let's um, get the caliper off. Here we go. And they are the brake pads. So can we go into spec inspect mode? Here we go. Let's inspect the brake disc. 
63 percent so it's okay it's um it will pass its mot let's in inspect that brake pad all oh, 13 percent right we better we better um disassemble uh no hang on i wanted to disassemble disassemble uh this is disassemble there we go brilliant okay we'll take those ones off now here we go um, great, you disassemble the old brake pads on one side. This time, uh, it's time to assemble the new ones. Well, okay. So, let's go to assemble. Let's put the new brake pad on. Uh, we got, yes, four. Good, they are singles, so we didn't we didn't overspend, which is great news. Yep, put that one on as well. Brilliant. Uh, one more thing. Remember to customer ask you to check this. I've already done that. I'm way ahead of you, tutorial. Keep up. Um... Okay, we better just do it again, just so the computer will recognise it. Oh look, 63%. Look, we did that already. Honestly, right? We need to um, need to assemble. We need to uh, put the caliber back on and screw that back in. Plunk. Click. Excellent. And stick the wheel back on. Why not? Yep. That's almost a new tire on there. Brilliant. I always do them in diagonal order. Because, just because, right, that's one side done, that's half the job done. How do we, okay, let's, uh, oh, E and Q are to zoom out. Oh, here we go. There we go. Zoom out. No, hang on. Ooh. Zoom in, zoom out. Brilliant. Uh, how do I, how do I, oh, I'm in disassemble mode. How do I come out of that? Let's go to, uh, I seem to be stuck. I seem to be. <laughs> well, uh, here we go. Hang on. I'm, I'm, I'm slowly. I'm sl no. I, I. I. How much have I been drinking, or how much is the? Uh... There we go. Escape. If in doubt, escape gets you out of it. Whoa. Right. So we really should be um, loosening these bolts. Whoa. Right. Uh, inspect the wheel. Oh, take the wheel off. We see. We should just loosen it, like a little bit like that. And then we should put the jack under. But never mind. Boom! Somehow they managed to catch the car before um, beforehand. Anyway, so we'll, we'll take all this off. It seems that we need to do all this before um, we, we do. Oops! No, don't want to take the brake disc off. No, I want to take that off. There we go. Uh, and now, for some reason, it makes sense to inspect it now, but they want us to put this on first. Yeah, put that one on. And put that one on. Yep. Okay, brilliant. Put the caliper back on. Yep. Plunk. Click. Oh, I wish changing your brakes really was that easy. It's not in actual fact. Right, we want to inspect that. 63%. Now oh, she's getting even wear on it both sides. Or he, he or she, I don't know. I assume this was a, a female's car. It might not be. It might not be. Clunk, 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 clunk. Okay, here you go. It's going to be our first job. Brilliant. Uh, is that done? Yes, 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 yes. Repaired. Boom. Why not? Let's proceed to the next order. I'm flying. So there you go. Change some brake pads. Oh my god, it's not. I, I've changed brake pads. It's not that easy. I wish it was that easy. But then you have to try and put. Because of the, uh, the worn brake pads come out, the, um, the the pistons in the caliper obviously are closer and you have to push them back, back out and that's, n if you've got an older car it's never an easy job, or a motorbike, oh my god, I almost broke my, anyway, right, this job, order two, <laughs> shut up, what are you talking about, um, replace the oil filter, replace the air filter first though, and then replace the fuel filter, at last, sorry, <laughs> at last, no, I last had my filters checked over a year ago, please replace them, okay, how much have I been drinking? I don't know. I know I've got coffee next to me. I'm not actually. It's it's during the day. It's um. So I'm not drinking. Okay, that's fine. Yes, we'll do that. Okay, we got another little um nice car. What do we need to do? I forgot. Filters, air filter, fuel filter, and oil filter. Brilliant. Um, we really need the make of the car so we can work out. Or is there just? There's just 
It looks like there's just one air filter, so we'll buy that. Yeah, we'll buy an air filter. Uh, we need a fuel filter, fuel filter. They're normally like a little round uh, fuel filter. There we go. And then a, uh, an oil filter is normally like a little round tin, which um, which is always good fun. Oh, oil filters are dead easy. To oh, okay. It's not kind of the oil filter I was expecting. It's normally all concealed in like a round. In a, anyway, brilliant. So we've got the um, the filters. I guess we'd better jack it up, haven't we? Whoa. Because if we're changing the oil filter, it makes sense to do an oil change at the same time because we're down here, aren't we? Whoa, okay. Um, inspect the engine. Right. Oh, God, hang on. What's that? That's the rubber bushing. No. Um, wow, how do I move around? Can I get... Oh, here you go. So that's probably the oil. No, it's not. It's the start motor. <laughs> uh, where is the oil filter? Where is the oil filter? It's normally towards the lower part of the engine if I can oh my god this is really this is actually if you've ever played this game it's actually quite tricky to um to control what the hell is the oil filter I would expect it to be sticking out the side here somewhere um do 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 oh that's the start mode because normally so we've got the gearbox oh god hang on what's this uh, unless it's unless it's sort of hidden. And these are these are drive belts. I don't know why I'm even bothering. Uh, how do I exit out of that? No, I wanted to exit out of that. Right, let's um, exit out of that. Right, fine. Let's go on. The fuel filter will be at the back where the uh, the fuel tank is. There we go. That's the fuel filter, isn't it? Yes, it is. I thought it was. Uh, do we want to inspect it just to see what condition it's in? Oh, 15%. Okay. Wow. What in a year? 15%. Wow. Wow. Okay, let's disassemble. Brilliant. Uh, let's assemble. Let's put the new one on. Brilliant. Well, there you go. That's the fuel filter done. Um, oh, do you mean to do that? Right. Uh, right. Let's do the air filter while. Um, so I don't know where, actually where the the oil filter is. Uh, this should be the air filter. This box here. Oh, hang on. This should be the air filter. It is the air filter. Brilliant. Uh, we need to disassemble. Oh, hang on. What's this? I need to disassemble that first. Are we in? I think we're in the wrong mode. Why can't we take that? We should be able to just unscrew that box and come. Does he want us to take all this off? You don't need to take all this off. Come on. Talk about a job's worth. We are we are stinging this person for labour costs. This is outrageous. These air filter boxes are designed to open up on their own. I don't know. You don't have to, you don't have to dismantle all this. What, what kind of car manufacturer does this? It's probably a Renault actually. Renaults are notoriously difficult to actually get to anything in their cars. Um, Put our brand new air filter in. Fantastic. And let's um, reassemble everything. The air box cover. Brilliant. Fantastico. Fantastico. Right, before we do that, let's have a look. So there's the. That's where the oil. Ah, is that the fuel filter? That could be the fuel filter there. It's. Uh, yeah, it's, it's. Okay, fine. You just couldn't see it from below. Well, I'm not sure that it is. I'm, I'm, I'm guessing that's what it is. Why can't I do that nut over there? I might just have to sell for three nuts because I can't. There we go. No. No. There we go. Okay, excellent. And then we stick the, the bit of pipe in. Yes. Wow, we just stung them for that. Uh, right. Let's. No, I do not want to do that. Let's. 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 Oil filler cap. Oh, filter cap even. Oh, okay. Oh, I see. It's a filter that falls... Well, okay, normally they're disposable all-in-one items. That's what confused me, I think. He says... Oh, no, hang on. I'm... I'm whoa. I've lost control. I've lost control of my face. Hang on. I wanna... I wanna... Uh, hang on. Hang on. 
Why won't you leave me alone? Right, we're coming out. Sometimes, like, there's obviously some sort of lock system, which um, I got stuck on. Right, so we're going to put that... No, no, stop it, stop it. Put the new oil filter in, put the cap on. Yes, brilliant. And um, so that's oil, air, fuel. That was it, wasn't it? How's it, wasn't it? Oh, we stopped. Um, I'm sure that was it. Was that it? Can we put the bonnet down? The hood? It's a bonnet. I know, not like a bonnet you wear on your head, but it is. That's what, yeah. Uh, right, okay, so that should be. Tick, tick, tick. $300. Boom. Oh, why not? Why not? One more. One more. Yeah, why not? We, we're, on a, we're on a roll. Making some good money today. Good money. Right. Here we go. Order three. Perform a test drive. Oh, okay. Replace all worn out parts. While I am driving on bumpy roads, I can hear a knocking from my front wheels. Check the car and replace the worn out parts, please. Hmm. Okay, fine. I am guessing that's probably your drop links. If you got an Alfa Romeo and it's knocking, it's most definitely probably the drop links. Uh, how do I close the door? Uh, hang on, maybe not. Do I? Ah, i got to open the doors first. Test track, yes! Okay, wow, we've got test trackers and everything. Oh, here we go. Right, checklist, acceleration, brake, slalom, and suspension test. Right, so we just... Whoa! It's got a nice sports exhaust on it by the sounds of it. This acceleration's done right. Where are we where are we going now? Can I can I move my head? No, okay. Are we gonna do a braking test in the red box by the looks of it? Brake. Brilliant, now a slalom, okay. Uh oh, I see. Understeering a little bit. Whoa. Okay, slalom. Now suspension test. Suspension. Oh, here we go. Oh. <gasps> brake. Oh, a little bit of a handbrake. Brilliant. Well, that, it's driving fine. I didn't hear any knocking, did you? I was screaming most of it. So, um, okay, so have a bit of coffee as we wait for that to load. Oh, okay, so it was a van. That's quite a pokey little van, actually, isn't it? And when I say pokey, I don't mean small and horrible. I mean it's got a bit of poke. It's got a bit of um, a bit of drive. Uh, right. So what was what were we supposed to do? Replace worn out parts. Okay. Uh, let's let's stick it up on the um. The G I, I'm taking we, when you say replace parts, so we're looking at um, suspension. Is that what we're doing? Is that what we're doing? Yeah, just having our inspect mode on. Right. Steer us. 67, 6, oh, they're okay, they, they're yellow, you know, oh here we go, some red bits, outer tie rods, okay, you need your, there you go, your end link, your sway bar, there you go, that's, well, your drop link, whatever, that, I told you that's what it would be, so we went sway link left, sway bar, end link right, uh, anything else, uh, and we know oh, we need, um, Outer tie rod. Yeah, everything else looks good, doesn't it? Okay, let's um, go to the back suspension. We oh, get the exhaust in our face. Full full exhaust. Um. Oh, the exhaust. Let's have a check. No, no, no! Don't 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 take it off. I just want to check on it. Oh, it's seventy-two. That's fine. 65, 70, can't check that, should we have a look at that, no, can't have a look at that, uh, no, okay, well, it looks like it's just those front bits, I reckon, so let's go over to our, we've got a bonnet there for some reason, uh, let's have a look at the computer, so we need car parts, we need, uh, what do we need, we need, I've forgotten already, um, 
I'm sure if I see it, I'll remember. No, not draw. We, we we want a sway bar, don't we? Right and left sway bar. End link. Uh. Whoa. Fifteen hundred dollars. I got a set of four for that price. Jeez, that's expensive. Um. Right. What are we looking for? We're looking for. We're looking for. Out of tie rod. We wanted one of those, didn't we? Did we? Did we? I'm sure we did. Yep, buy one of those. Uh, uh, maybe, yeah. Uh, no, 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 no. Aha, here we go. 50, 50 bucks a piece. Excellent, that's what we needed. Right. Oh, walk straight into that. <laughs> Hatching's metal work. Okay. Um, right, first off. Let's replace uh, that. Oh well, let's go into dis dis disassemble mode. Can we? Can we not go into dis what? Oh, here we go. I'm, I've got. I've got. Angle my head. Um, what? Okay, this has gone a bit weird now. Get control. Get control. Um, okay, hang on. Let's try that again. I don't know. It's, it, the, mm. Right, so we need to replace the drop links. Where's the... there. So, let's... Let's replace that. Why, why, why? Why won't it allow us to do that? Does it need to be on the ground? It shouldn't need to be. Anyway, let's put it on the ground to see if that makes a difference. Oh. Can I get in there? No, see, I can't get in there now, can I? No. Okay. Right. No, no, that wasn't it. Oh. Well, we're learning. We're learning. You know, I've got no certificate to say that I'm a qualified mechanic. They're just, just, just trusting me with a car, you know? Right, um, do we have to go, are we in inspect? We are in that mode, aren't we? Okay. Ah, here we go, there we go, I zoomed in a little bit. Can I zoom out a little bit? Here we go, can we, no. Ah, okay, I'm wondering, oh, I, oh, we're going to have to take this apart, aren't we? That's what they're saying, isn't it? Isn't it? Is it? Is that what they're saying? Do you want me to disassemble that? Is that what you're saying? Is that what you're saying? No, it's not what you're saying, is it? Any ideas? I'm throwing it open to the room. Why Why can't I? What am I doing wrong? What am I doing? Do they want me to take the wheel off? I shouldn't have to. Right, should we inspect that bit? Is that, is that bit okay? That's, that bit's fine. Okay. Uh, what was what was the job? Replace warm parts. Right. Fine. Let's um. That's oh, the radio. I'm making that. Oh, it's going so well. It's going so well. So we're going to take the wheel off and we're going to attack it from the side. Uh, like any good um. Home DIY mechanic. Excellent. Right. We go. Look, we can reach it now. This is. Uh, you see, it's easy when you know how, isn't it? It's easy, right? We wanna, we wanna change that to assemble. Put the brand new one on. Screw that in. Ah, oh, fantastic! Look at that. No, nope, we don't want the tire in the way. We wanna get to this now. Right. Um. So yeah, we wanna take that off. Ah, oh, we honestly. Uh, hang on. If I can get my... There we go. Just a matter of getting me, uh, me, uh, my ratchet to it. Okay. We're flying. Just a logic puzzle at the end of the day. There we go. Brilliant. Right, put the wheel back on. Yep, 63%. It's fine. It's all legal.
Excellent. Right. Other side. Right, we just got one more tie rod to do. Or not tie rod, drop link. Sway bar. Majing. Okay. Uh, is that we wanted to remove? Yes. Ah. Okay. Uh, assemble mode. Put a brand new one on. Let's screw that in. Fan tazzy-tastic. Excellent. Let's put the wheel back on. Yes. Oh. Uneven wear across the uh, the front there. Uh, it's obviously probably towing out a little bit. Brilliant. Okay. Job done. Tick, tick, tick. Repaired. Boo. It's a Reventon van that was. Well, there we go. That's three quick jobs. Do you want? Should we squeeze in? We, let's just see what. If this is going to be another easy job, I'll squeeze another easy job in. Uh, perform an OBD scan. What the hell? An onboard? No. What's an OBD? <laughs> onboard computer. Can you scan the onboard computer? I need to know if there are any electronic electronic parts are reporting errors. Okay. Fine. Um, last job. We'll quickly do this. I'm guessing there's probably. Uh, somewhere we plug it in in here is there? Is there on? The... If we go, God, easy as pie. If not, I knew it was going to be on top of the com of the uh, engine somewhere. Right, reading EE Pro M. Twenty-five percent. Some checking for errors. Finalizing. Done. Okay. Do we not get the results? How do we get the results? Oh, we're on the radio. Uh, onboard computer television. Okay, I don't know. Right, um, right, brilliant. Do we need to download those onto the computer or something to um, to figure out what's what? I think we probably have to, don't we? Uh, do we need to? No, clearly not. Was that it? Was that it? Done. Oh, boom. <laughs> It was that simple. God knows if they had any errors. Uh, we didn't bother looking. We just uh, maybe it comes up on the ODB scanner. I don't know. Well, there we go, guys. Boom. We'll select. We'll take that. Um, there we go. Car mechanic simulator 2014. Have you enjoyed it? Do you want to see any more? Let me know. If so, I'll do some more, and uh, we'll go from there. Oh, we got to repair a starter motor by the looks of it. Wow. Okay. So there we go. I'll leave it there for now, guys. Let me know what your thoughts. If you want to see any more, um, I'm happy to play more. It's quite good fun. Although this this mouse control is a little bit. Oh, it's got some nice. It's quite a nice little garage actually. I wish I had a workshop like this. Quite nice, isn't it? There we got some um, old classic car, 2013. We might as well take that down now. Uh, we got some some laughing gas there. Look, and uh, we got some old racing uh, posters up. We got some ninja soda. Uh, Look at this, super motor oil, Ooh, and sports lube, ah, oh, sports lube, heavy duty sports lube, oh, you can't beat that. <laughs> oh, look at these, look at these posters, brilliant. Pittsburgh Vintage Grand Prix, 2012, that's not that vintage. Oh look, we've got an old engine block, we're storing a bottle of wine in, it's perfect, perfect for starting, storing, oh my god, who did the wiring? Jeez, honestly. Um, yes, it's quite nice though. It's quite nice, isn't it? Oh, nice. Oh, nice car there. Ooh. And and again, we're using um, soda cans on um, engine blocks. Brilliant. And we got some tubs and, and bits and pieces. Brilliant. Well, there we go. That's a quick guide. I wasn't planning to do that. It's, oh, what's this? Oil container. Oh, okay. For oil changes, I guess. Air conditioning. Can we go in there? No. There we go. Well, anyway, sorry guys, I got distracted saying goodbye. Um, so yes, if you'd like to see any more, let me know, and I can happily do some more. I am quite enjoying it. I will, I will figure out that mouse sensitivity issue, and we'll get that closed down. But there you go, guys. Thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed it, and if you have, then join me next time. Mm -hmm.